Welcome to my channel, Love and Light. Welcome to my channel. If you are new here, please hit that subscribe button. And to all of my subscribers and my first timers that are just watching my video, would you please go ahead and hit that like button on that video? Uh, YouTube is wanting us to uh, communicate more. They, they like it when you like those videos. It keeps it out there. It will help my channel grow. Um, so I would appreciate that very much. Um, thank you to all of the ones who uh, had me do a reading for them today. Um, thank you for trusting in me, believing in me, believing in yourself, which is most important. Uh, most of them are my return customers. Thank you for having that faith in me. Uh, but uh, today is going to be the last video that I do for Tamiya Taylor. Um, unless something just drastic comes up about Tamiya, um, we're just not going to do another reading on her. Um, I feel like that it's time we give it a rest. We give her family a rest. We give her mother a rest. Um, the pain that was in that lady's eyes, it, it was in her whole entire face. Not just her eyes. Her whole face was filled with pain when I watched that last interview. That's a very strong woman. That's a strong woman in her faith. Her faith carries her through. Uh, there is no... Um, in between with her she is she she is faithful she is a strong willed faithful person with God on her side and like she said she asked God for one thing and that was to bring her baby home whether it was alive or if she had to bury her to please give her some comfort and he did answer that for her and she is grateful for that. And she praises him for that. So if we can say a prayer for the mother, even if you're not a Christian, it's not, I mean, what do you got to lose to say a prayer for her? You ain't, if you're not a Christian, you ain't got nothing to lose, right? Go ahead and uh, say a prayer for her, um, for her Christianity that she believes in. Um, because it's definitely getting her through, getting her through. She should never have to bury her child. Um, so I want to, um, what I picked up on Tamiya. I pick up that Tamiya, um, continues to live the same moments over and over and over and over and over i say it that many times because that's how it's coming to me it's just continuously she keeps reliving those moments leading up to it all the way through it not the moments that before she got on but after she got on she's living those moments continuously and um, when I picked that up, I had to think, and, and it makes sense because when you think about it, when a person drowns, they tell us that uh, your whole life flashes in front of your eyes, you know, I guess since you were a baby to, you know, just your whole life, everything that been going on flashes through and that's kind of what's going on with Tamia um, except for that she's not she's not aware that uh, she she's gone gone okay so she keeps reliving those moments that leads up to it and she keeps reliving that moment over and over again. I do believe that she will find her way. I do believe that she will have peace. I do believe that she will feel um, that her family will feel her great presence once she stops. Or I can't say once she stops because 
and the spiritual that she's in right now. She's not in her our homemade bodies, you know. Uh, so once she realizes or knows that, boom, she's going to drown all over, okay? If she was either forced to drown or however it was that she drowned, because there was water in her lungs, she did drown. She, that's when her whole life is going to flash in front of her, and then that's when she's going to know. But right now, that hasn't happened with her. Right now, she's still in that time. She's still in that moment. Um, I do want to ask the cards on Samia if she will get justice in one way or another. If it's through police justice or if it's through um, justice that uh, they push and they make the folks have better security cameras, have better security everything. Okay? So I want to know if she's going to get judgment. That way, will, will she get judgment? It does she need to get judgment to the police department? And I do believe the organization that's working with the mother is going to push some of those things. She's going to have some type of a uh, peaceful resolution. She got the peaceful resolution card. She will have um, a peaceful resolution. But that is, um, like I said, judgment through the police department, judgment or uh, pushing the boats to actually do something, put some cameras downtown on them cobblestones, you know, put some cameras on them boats, uh, what not. Uh, there will be a peaceful resolution to that. Um, <clears throat> it actually pulls me more towards um, the boats, okay, like getting cameras, and things like that. Okay. So now we're going to pull. Okay, her situation does improve. The situation that is going on with Tamiya right now that I explained to y'all about, she hasn't. Although she's drowned, she hasn't drowned in her whole life, hasn't flashed in front of her eyes, and she hasn't made it to that moment yet. Okay? She's still in the moment of the boat. Okay? She's still reliving that every, every time she relives that. Okay? That situation will most definitely improve, okay? And like I told you, when it does, it, it's um, going to be a bittersweet for her because she's going to realize that she's gone and she'll stop reliving that moment over and over and she will be able to see the light go down her path and uh, the sad part to it, the bitter part is not physically 
but spiritually she will have the full effects of drowning again and her life will finally flash in front of her and the, it, it progresses from there okay then she'll start finding her way and I do believe she is no once that happens I do believe she's going to show a big presence around her uh, mother around her children but I think her mother is going to be the one that feels her presence during comforting times um I do believe her brother is going to be able to feel her presence in comforting times also uh didn't really ask if she was gonna and didn't really tell us if she was gonna receive any justice other than the one card I pulled and that pulls me more towards the the bone you know doing actually doing something says a year from now so this may be a uh, oh what do you call it because her I don't know how you would do it her uh, her death was of drowning but it's also the manner of the way that drowning happened is, is undetermined at this time so within a year we will hear about the undetermined. If it was accidental, it will be changed to accidental drowning, or it would be changed to a homicide. So, any time from now to a year that that's going to happen. So, we'll find out then. And right now, like I said, just um, we need to give the family peace. We need to let all of this sink in. We need to let them continue with their prayers and look to what makes them feel better and let them heal the way they prefer to heal. And peace, love, and light, guys.